I'm Lawrence for iSpot Interviews aboard the Celebrity Cruise Ship, The Summit, and today we are docked in the Caribbean, and I'm with Olivia, originally from Romania, who both in fitness and in spa has had instructor and managerial responsibility. Olivia, what's been the most exciting part of traveling the world from the point of view of fitness and spa and health? It's a very, very tough question to be honest with you because there is a lot of exciting stuff. Like besides the fact that you're traveling, besides the fact that you see the world, besides the fact that you meet these exciting people, it's amazing to see the transformation that's something that you can um, push to some people. Like for example, people, will, especially during this time of year, people will come with a New Year's resolution. And there's someone will say, you know what, I want to make a change. I, I'm, I'm finished with the way I feel. I don't want to feel bad anymore. I want to feel better. And it's amazing to see that drive in some people to see the way they change and what they want to become. The drive that makes them become what they want to become. That's beautiful. So you help motivate them. And what kind of tools do you provide with Canyon Ranch at Sea for people to allow them to continue the experience once they get home? Well, basically what we do is start to all with the seminars. The seminars are very, very engaging with the guests and specifically by, based on their needs. Most of the people that we see, they want to lose a little bit of weight and they want to feel better. So we start everything from the seminar. The seminar, we see those people that are really motivated and they just come to listen, they just come to, to get the information, to get what they want. The next step is booking the consultation with us so we see exactly what, I'm, what we're working with, what's the main issue and what's the main goal. And based on that, we see what we can do. And we change the nutrition plan, we change the exercise plan. For example, I have some people where I do the exercise plan, I do it on video because they wanna, they wanna learn how to exercise, so I do the routine with them, videotaping them and listening to the sound of my voice so they can have my, the, the amazing sound of my voice even at home. And as a trainer, I can say that's very generous because far few and between are the trainers who say, I will do that for you. Most at their best will give you a piece of paper with some exercises circled that you're supposed to do at home. So that's wonderful that you do that. Yes. What about the barefoot program to enhance how their balance and foot health happens? Yes, yes, how do they take that home? Yes, that is that is also included in this because most of the people start to have after even after 30 years old, they start to have postural problems. After I hit 30, I'll work on that. Try that, but you still have a long way to that. So basically, most of the people, because we're designed actually to walk barefoot, there are certain muscles and tendons in our foot that are not activated and they're being actually protected by the shoe. So what we do is we do a foot scan. We see exactly how you walk and based on that, we see what the problems are and how we can fix them. Nine times out of 10, we have to just put an orthotic, a corrective orthotic in your shoe so it corrects the way you walk. By correcting the way you walk, it's correcting your posture, it's correcting your balance. It's overall giving you more strength actually because your body's working the way it's supposed to work. Especially for us in the spa industry who give and work in the spa industry. Yes. We're standing all day. Yes. Many, very few of us actually sit. So orthotics, even for standing, sometimes help you learn how to have proper biomechanics in your feet. Yes, because if you notice, there's people when they, like us now, we're standing straight, right? But you see, if I well, speak to someone- not some, so straight in this case, but well, yeah. If you see, when we speak to someone, you'll notice that after five minutes, they tend to end up like this, right. or they lean on something. That's faulty biomechanics. So just by judging just from that, we can see the change of it. Like for example, me right now, I'm wearing the orthotics and I don't feel the need to lean on the side. I'm not feeling the need to lean forward or lean against something. My body is very comfortable standing straight. Wonderful. And in terms of taking home orthotics for posture, because we're always gonna walk, in terms of taking home movement routines, you give that to them. Yes. In terms of other seminars for how to improve the way they'll eat, you give that to them. Yes. And then in terms of the outside, skincare, you also sell at the spa. There's yes. so many ways to take home yes. a new, fresher, more vibrant outside as well. Yes. So yes. Canyon Ranch at Sea is sort of a, a one-stop shop. Can yes. be if you don't just visit for the cycle class. Yes. What's the longest time you've had passengers at sea without getting off like a, a transatlantic crossing? Um, this is a good one. I had, I was fortunate enough to work on a cruise ship called Canyon Ranch where I did the world cruise. So I stayed up until January, up until April, if I'm, yeah, April if I was there and I had, we had almost a thousand guests that stayed for the entire voyage. Four months. And I had one guest, I met him in the first day of my contract. I started in the beginning of the world cruise and I had the, the opportunity to meet him. And he was a gentleman about 77 years old and 
the list of medical problems was ridiculously bad. Four types of cancer, you survived. Uh, high blood pressure, the degenerative um, the disc Bone diseases. Disorder, yeah. A lot of a lot of problems. And I remember I, I convinced him to book a session, and after that session, I spoke with his wife, and the wife was saying, um, he keeps saying, I don't know what's wrong with him, he keeps saying that this is going to be his last cruise because he just gives up on life. He doesn't want to live anymore, just wants to take a tour around the world and just give up on life. So we did one session, after that session we kind of bonded a little bit, he did another six and then he ended up booking the entire world tour. So it was about four months of training where we seen, I've seen him every single day. So we ended up losing about 100 pounds. 100 uh, pounds at 77 years old. Yes, young. yes. Um, we were starting like for example, if he was walking and you would just pass by in front of him, he wouldn't be able to stop. Because he would just fall over, his balance, his posture was very bad. And you, I remember he was always complaining about the fact that he's going on tours for disabled people. He's playing with wheelchairs and scooters and stuff like that. By the time I finished with him, he was going hiking, he was going bike riding, we were doing kickboxing trainings. Like he was a complete, complete change. His not just physical appearance, right. but his mental state changed completely. And it was amazing to see how much a little motivation can do for you. It was astonishing to see that kind of change. And different from the rest of the world, what Canyon Ranch at Sea provides in that experience is a support system. Yes. So you can eat healthy, you can meditate healthy, yes. you can be around like-minded individuals yes. to support your journey. A gym that's almost 24-7, spa for the outside, and you as motivational expert for that entire four-month period. That's a great microcosm of the most unique definition that I found of sort of transformational support system because your support system travels, but every day you open your door, you're in a new country of the world, still working on your wellness journey. Yes, yes. Very yes. inspirational. Thank you, Livio, you're for sharing that inspirational story of how wellness is far more the buzzword of spa anymore than fitness used to be, and just skincare. It's now wellness from the inside out and outside in. From all of us in your series of iSpa interviews, I'm Lawrence asking iSpa, do you?